EA Sports. Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of the Portuguese Liga Zon Sagres. Now, did you know one of these teams does not have a win in the league all season? Today's the day I can just feel it. Your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Hi there, Martin Tyler with you once more. Alan Smith again alongside me. It's got to be... Oh! That'll mean a lot to him, that particular goal. Well, the first goal is always important for any player and that should enable him to kick on and feel a lot more comfortable. Now. Hard and low, in for the corner. Great finish. Well, it was a marvellous finish, Martin. He's in the right place at the right time there. Wonderful goal. And the score is 1-0. There's an attack now from Benfica. cards here from the referee and he's keeping the cards in his pocket just a free kick sliding in and uh, taking his part in the game into uh, uh, a dangerous territory really well he's dived in it's a reckless one the wall lined up in the right place gets his foot in there Second goal here, and he's showing his new fans what he's made of. Yeah, he's, he's settling in and looking better and better by the match, and this couple of goals won't do him any harm at all. And it's 2-0 here. Here. Oh, oh, the goalkeeper saved it. Well, 
those one-on-one -on -one situations. It's difficult for both parties, but I think he came out on top there. Good work by the defender. Really headed the ball powerfully away. Sammy. Andre. Well, the attacker is now spoilt for choice, really, in terms of support. Challenged quickly by the opposition. Matic, Silvio, that certainly will help him fit into his new surroundings, Alan, won't it, to get two goals here? I think so, it would maybe have just started to play on his mind, the fact that he hadn't uh, found the score sheet, so, yeah, he'd be delighted with that. News of a goal from elsewhere, Alan McInally. It's a goal for Vilo do Conde. 23 minutes played, 1-1. Thanks, Alan. Which way is he going to go now? Support on either side. He's one possession. Opportunity to cross it now. Brilliant opening. Got to be, and the goalkeeper very much on his game today. Funes Mori. The visitors can keep this run going, Alan. Looking for win number five in succession. Well, they almost come here as favourites, don't they, on form? So uh, let's see if they can dominate possession. team by that offside flag. Oh. I don't think he was on, but when they look at the replays after this match, they'll realise the official made a good call there. Perez. Eduardo Salvia. He's backed up on the left-hand side. The defenders come in well here. Timed his uh, approach and got the ball. He's cleaned up here, hasn't he, with that clearance. Here's the opportunity. Can he knock the ball upfield? Sammy. Oh, he's got support here. Still a chance after the save. He got there just in time. In the end, a fantastic clearance. Eduardo Salvia. Nemanja Matic. Good movement off the ball. And the referee is blown for half time. It's 2 0 here. Well, this is why we use the expression David and Goliath, because David was the underdog and he won. And uh, the underdogs here are halfway to winning. Yeah, well, I think the key thing now. And we've got another 45 minutes to go. And uh, set your watches, off we go. Sammy. Here's the chance. Attack. 
definitely the best form of defending the lead they've got already. I think, Callum, the home team need a win. A couple of draws in their last two games, that's slightly unsatisfactory. Yeah, and I think they do need that win just to give them a bit of confidence, which they've been lacking over the last two. Emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Options available on the bench for the away side today. Silvio. Positional play of this play is really good. Silvio. Eldon. Strong tackle to break up the play. Nemanja Matic. Close range chance. Oh, off the post. What a good piece of defensive clearance that was. Job. Eldon. understand his eagerness to try and get in they're holding a high line but he's offside it's a tactical substitution for the losing team here manager thinking for the away side time for a change could be a goal well, it could be off keeper got a touch I think put them even further ahead it is men against boys and uh, there's only one winner here I think well it was a marvelous finish Martin he's in the right place at the right time there wonderful goal Eduardo Salvia here comes the cross good interception the defensive player there trying to get possession back well here comes a substitution for the away team Matic. He's backed up on the left-hand side. Out for a throw. And over the touch line. He's coming off now, but he surely deserves all the applause he's getting. Yeah, he was bright and lively.
Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of the Portuguese Liga Sadness. So without further ado, we're off to the stadium. Here's your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Everything ready for the kickoff. Hi there, Martin Tyler with you once more. Alan Smith again alongside me. Portuguese football, the Liga Portuguesa. And uh, Alan, I'm sure you're anticipating a decent fixture. Yeah, great to be here as always. Give us your insight onto the away team today, strength and weaknesses. Yeah, I think a predictable start for this side, a team that uh, we build as a mid-table one at the start of the season. And uh... surely, could it be? Might be needed again, the goalkeeper. Their positions here, they know their jobs defending this corner. Tried to steer it in with the volley, and the keeper able to hold the shot. News of a goal from elsewhere, Alan McInally. It's a goal for Lisbon North. 11 minutes played, 1-0. Thank you very much, Alan. Referee has pointed for a corner. That corner didn't produce the chance that they were hoping for. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. He will be determined to do a bit better than in his recent games. He is better than those performances have shown, surely he is. Yeah, and I think uh, the manager, rightfully so, he's given him a, another chance, but I've seen over the last couple of weeks, confidence has been low. Well, he did well to try it, really. In this part of the pitch, it's OK. OK. about his form recently been struggling hasn't he it's not the kind of form that we've become accustomed to with this lad I don't know what's going on news of a goal from elsewhere Alan McInally it's a goal for Benfica 27 minutes played 1-1 thanks Alan could be dangerous crosses in player there he's found it well any danger to the goal has gone with that clearance didn't hesitate did he with that challenge chance for the cross shots on here the referee does blow the flag was up from the assistant
they've been uh, thwarted here. That's a sign of better things to come. from the defender. Okay. And they cut it out. Sammy. So many chances, and this one's been taken splendidly. They've got so many playmakers, haven't they? Players that can pick out a pass, and it's just too much for the opposition. Andre. It's a headed effort at goal, and the referee is blown for half time. It's 2 0 here. So we reach half time with the score 2 0. Let's take a look back at the highlights from that first half, and then we'll be back over to your commentary team for the second half. It's a tactical substitution for the losing team here. Here we go with the start of the second half. Danger. No mistake about that. Here's the opportunity. Oh, and he's put it away. I think he is as surprised as the rest of us, the defender. I think so. I think he got a nosebleed you so far up the pitch, but he didn't panic, did he? We've got to hand it to this boy. He has got that instinct for knowing exactly where to position himself in the box. And the score is 3-0. News of a goal from elsewhere, Alan McInally. It's the second goal for Benfica. 50 minutes, please. 2-1. Cheers, Alan. What a chance here. He's got the goal. He got there just in time. In the end, a fantastic clearance. Interception there is key, really, to the side that's having to defend at the moment. Options available on the bench for the away side today. Well, that pass saw the chance to grab the ball at the feet of the attacking player. Well, if the striker would have got his foot to it and nicked it away, I think it'd have been a penalty. Defender has done very well here, got his foot in. He's enduring a sticky spell at the moment, but they're asking him to play his way through it, Alan. I'm not surprised at that. I really thought that the manager would give him a little rest to, to watch on from the sidelines, but no. Andre. Great opportunity. He takes the shot. Fantastic save. Got the ball well to set his team on the front foot by intercepting. Challenge here. And the defenders come in well here 
timed his uh, approach and got the ball. Cheeky, a back heel. Great chance, and the shot's on. But it has hit the goalkeeper, and it's deflected into the net. Well, he's got his second goal of the game, and it's very well taken. Well, this is going to be a change here for the team that is leading, and it's clearly a tactical one to try and cement that winning position. And the score now reads 4-0. He committed himself here, there wasn't much cover, but he got the ball, the defender, in the wide position. Could be a gap here. And here's a shot now, and that's the keeper's athleticism there to make that save. Corner to be taken. taken it is a substitution now. Welcome to EA Sports, live coverage of the Liga Portuguesa. Here's your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Hi there, I'm Martin Tyler. Alan Smith is with me. We should have a fine game for you today. Well, great interest here, of course, locally, because of the geography of the two sides. They know each other's game so well, they live in the same parish. Archivaldo Pombal takes charge of this game today. The player, this guy, that the opposition have really got to keep an eye on the form that he's in. Yeah, I mean, his teammates will be trying to give him the ball at every opportunity. He demands it, he can do special things with it. It's looking good, this move.
another volley. Oh, he's had a crack here. Well, it was all about making the right connection. He just couldn't quite manage it. Referee has pointed for a corner. That's really the way to get the ball out of the danger zone. Good position here. And it's back to him again. Well, no wonder we're picking him out at the start because he's been in terrific form. What a player. Oh, yeah, he's uh, he has been in a terrific kind of form and uh, you'd expect that to continue here. his trademark on the match well he's been playing some amazing football this lad and the way he took that goal it was a reflection of that it's a great goal from a very good team yeah and i think their midfielders martin they are a class above the opponents today and the score is one nil Tails. done all the spade work himself just couldn't produce the finish a word from you Alan on a player who is uh, a star turn really in this team isn't he yeah I've really enjoyed watching him over the last few weeks everything he's touched has turned to gold Contra. fabulous clearance now they've got the ball can they Attack here. It's a good tackle. And it leads to this shot. That's one back with a very successful tackle and a chance of a counter attack. like this in midfield you need a player with a bright mind and he's done that this player it's a good way to nick the ball back quick thinking this is a guy who really is on top of his game at the moment and uh, no wonder he started he's probably the first name on the team sheet yeah I would imagine so and the opposition I'm sure would have spoken a lot about him in the dressing room beforehand a danger man a big call by the assistant the flag has gone up he would have been in for goal yeah it was a wonderful opportunity but uh, looking back on it afterwards they can have no complaints held on that's a clever part of football isn't it to back heel the ball like that Andre straight in sharply read it well got in there quickly Uh, approach and got the ball 
on track. well to set his team on the front foot by intercepting. Andre. Assistant looking very confident about that one. He flagged, the referee gave the offside. And that's half-time, signalled by the referee, 1-0 the half-time score. Well, we've had a breakthrough, Alan, but decisive, do you think? I wouldn't uh, bank on it. It doesn't appear to be a good... So here we go with the second half. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Held on. In a goal, and the shot's on. Surely he's going to score here. Here's the chance. He's away. In on the keeper. Wasn't very confident defending, but it's done the job. on the bench for the home team. Everything he does just shines with confidence and belief. He's, he's in fine form. And that was that team at their very best, Alan. Well, coming in from the right, that was so inviting. Wonderful delivery. Great ball, great goal. Well, you look at the defender on his heels and you look at the goal scorer. He was on his toes. Now it's 2-0. Tackling is a real skill. Sammy. He read it, cut it out. Options available on the bench for the away side today. Eldon. Got an away team that have come here in very good fettle. 11 points from the line. Here's the opportunity. Taken on the full. Well blocked, not through for him to chase, he won't get it though. Into the face of the opposition.
Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of the Portuguese Liga Zon Sagres. Your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Hi there, everyone. Martin Tyler here with me today. I'm delighted to welcome Alan Smith. Oh, hi there, Martin. Absolutely delighted to be here. Alan, well, it's the away team we look at now. In your opinion, please. Well, they can't complain about the, the season they've enjoyed so far. They've probably had them down as a mid table side at best, but. I finish no, I'm in for at the moment and uh, still a long way to go but um, they have done a lot long so far and the referee today Rodolfo Costinha it's a think ball that doesn't come off for this team Andre Sammy Good forward play from them. Clever change of direction there. so far in this season with six yeah maybe one of those could do better could do worse but uh, he's a talented boy too eager too early offside
plunged for the ball, made the contact, and once he made contact, Alan, I think it was always going to be a goal. Yeah, he got good power behind it, and he got the accuracy as well, which made the, the keeper's efforts useless, really. Well, it was a teasing cross, and he's just thrown himself at that ball. And what a finish it was. You don't see too many of those diving headers these days. team that have come here in very good fettle 11 points in the last five league games yeah they've uh, they've got a good spirit about them and they've certainly got good character in this side he's cut it out and he's cut out the danger no mistake about that quickly back to his feet Andre To it. Great chance! Oh! Now they've got a corner on the attack again, the team that's leading by one goal. from him. They're chipping away this side, the home team, haven't they? Six points from the last five games. Yeah, not what you call spectacular, but solid and uh, a basis to maybe kick on. Some good runs to his right from his teammates. weaker side Alan didn't they and uh, it was a good policy as it's turned out yeah, a good bit of knowledge from the defender but I think he needs to brush up on that weaker foot Eldon signal for half time and it's 1-0 here half time and nothing really decided as yet Alan no and I think it might just be the one goal that does separate these two sides because it's been so tight so we reach half time and we've got another 45 minutes to go and uh, set your watches off we go that's a decent challenge by the opponent well they're in a good position here Eldon Here comes the cross. It's in. Brilliant header. Up he went. Great contact. And he put it away with that dangerous head of his. The heading, just like shooting, is an art form that needs practice. And this boy seems to have done exactly that because that was an emphatic finish. Well, that has made it 2-0. Team about to make a change. Unmarked now, he's lost his marker. Well, the defender panicking there, he just got the ball away.
sort of power into that. He must have scored, Alan, but it was a miss kick, really. Yeah, he just needed a, a sweeter connection, and he surely would have scored. A little too eager to get in behind the opposition, caught offside. Well, they're still trailing, and they need to do something now if they want to get back into this game. Maybe some fresh legs will do the trick. piece of defensive clearance that was. Oh, Muscle's gone for that player. Options available on the bench for the away side today. In at goal. Looked a bit panicky from the defender. Sammy. He's found his teammate. What a chance here. Goal kick here. down on both benches with something